idea of popcorn streets. Main hu Pooja. Fights, scandals, controversies, affairs. Let's take a look at all that kept Bollywood buzzing this week in our headlines. After being released from jail, Sanjay Dutt has been inspired to start writing a memoir of his experiences he had in prison. Director Raju Hirani is already in the process of making his very own Sanjay Dutt biopic featuring Ranbir Kapoor. Although the film will not be focusing on his troubles with the law, Sanjay Dutt is now discussing stories from his newfound inspiration with people close to him and probably potential filmmakers. According to sources, the last time Dutt shared an idea with someone, it was made into a successful film and they did not even cast him in the film. Hollywood studios have finally realized the potential in Indian markets and have been releasing films in India ahead of the US. Films are released in India usually a week prior to its US release, but in the case of Inferno, the release is prior by two whole weeks. A source close to the film said Academy Award-winning filmmaker Ron Howard's forthcoming film Inferno, starring Tom Hanks and Irfan, will release in India on October 14th this year, two weeks ahead of the US release date, October 28th. This decision was taken to avoid clashes with the release of any big Bollywood projects during the same time, as the makers are hoping for a bigger Indian audience during Diwali due to Irfan's fan following in India. The very young and talented director Bijoy Nambiar, after his recent release Wazir, is all set to start working on a remake of Agni Na Chatira, which was a 1988 hit Tamil film made by the legendary Mani Ratna. When asked about who would join the cast list, he simply said, "We will announce all that in some time." This is a story of two brothers and how their relationship changes over time. The original film had Prabhu and Karthik in the lead. As always, share your thoughts with us by commenting below.